Hi, Jenny here with Usborne Books and More, and now I'm going to show you some of my very favorite um, and our popular story time books. So if you're familiar with um, Dirty Dinosaur, then your kids will love I'm a Hungry Dinosaur. It's the exact same dinosaur, and he's making a cake. And instead of mud, the pictures are written in uh, frosting and then in real sprinkles. So again, you have the repetitive words and little rhyming, so it's great for those kids who are learning how to read to build that confidence. Another really fun book we have is Big Book of Little Stories. It comes with this bookmark. There are 15 stories in this book. We have the familiar ones like Little Miss Muffet, um, Little Riding Hood, and then there are some unfamiliar ones like The Dragon Who's Lost His Roar, which is like my favorite. And you can see the pictures are really bright and vibrant. And so just a really super cute, fun book to have. Next one is Nibbles. This is one of our brand new books this year. It is... Uh, about this little monster who likes to nibble on books and then he actually goes through um, and changes stories so there's books in the book and then the very end um, you gotta catch him and so that's Nibbles the Book Monster super cute interactive book another great interactive book is A Squirrel's Tale or A Mouse About the House it comes with this cute little squirrel and then you just follow the trail and then each page has a slit and you put them through and then he comes through the whole page and he goes through the entire book. And so at a very young age, you're teaching the kids to read from left to right, which is a great learning tool. So this is A Squirrel's Tale. One of my favorite bedtime stories is I Love You, Animally. Um, it's a super cute book that talks about how you love your kid, like each different animal. It talks about I love you bravely like an eagle. I love you fairly like a seagull. I love you exceedingly like a giraffe. And so um, just then again, a really cute bedtime story. So it's I Love You, Animally. One of my brand new favorites, and I do have a lot of favorites, is the Illustrated Alphabet. It comes with this slip case. Um, it is cloth, um, hardback binding. I love it because it's talking about the alphabet, which is obviously a great learning tool. And then there's also a cute little story about the alphabet zoo. And so each page has the upper and lowercase letter, and then it talks about that specific animal. So we have D is for donkey. The donkey's dinner was so dirty and disgusting, she kicked it over the fence. And so, like I said, what's happening at Alphabet Zoo? So again, a great bedtime story while you're teaching the kids the entire alphabet. And then even has it in the back. So super cute, illustrated alphabet. Another great bedtime book is 5-Minute Bedtime Stories. We also have 10-Minute Bedtime Stories, so I guess choose your pick, 5 or 10. Um, this one has 11 stories in it. And again, there's about five minutes. I have tested it out, and it really is about five minutes. And so there are cute little pictures, bright, fun illustrations, the words, and it is a little cush binding at hardback, and so a fun little book. Um, our phonics books are even great bedtime stories, because they're also short, and then they're even fun for the kids to read. So this is Raccoon on the Moon, and then this one is Underpants for Ants, and I'll just show you the inside. So the words are not very big, um, there aren't very many on the page so the kids don't get too overwhelmed by it and so it's just a cute little story and like I said they're pretty short and so great bedtime stories and then in the very back it talks about phonics and how you as a parent can help your kids who are just learning how to read so these are great um, phonics books we do actually have a lot of AR books too so check those out if you're interested and let me know if you have any questions and the last one I'm going to show you is Dan the Taxi Man. This is a really fun, kind of exciting jig book. I don't know if you want to do it for bedtime because it might get your kids all riled up. But it's a great um, story time book. So it talks about Dan the Taxi Man. So go into the show and pick him up the band. Climb inside while you still can. With Dan, beep, beep the taxi man. And so it kind of just goes through the whole book, that little jig and little rhyming. And it's just a super cute um, book. So there you go, Dan and the Taxi Man. So those are some of my favorite story time books for your kids. 